Hi guys, Christy here with It's a Book Thing. So I went book crazy this week, absolutely crazy, and bought so many books, I can't even tell you. Oh, um, not enough time in the world to read everything that I bought this week. So I'm going to do a really quick book haul. I'll have another one next week. I went on Amazon today and went a little crazy. Um, so I'll have another book haul for you next week. So let's get it started. So the books that I got to put on my tab, my Galaxy tab, are Wake by Amanda Hawking. Um, which I just saw on BookTube and people really, you know, had a lot of good things to say about it. So I thought, what the heck? So um, it's Wake, um, the Water Song series, the first one in the Water Song series by Amanda Hawking. It's the first book on my book haul today. The second book on my book haul is Oracle Glass by Judith Riley. Now, I don't know a lot about this book. Um, it just looked really, really interesting to me. So I went ahead and picked it up. It's gotten a lot of really great reviews. So I'm excited to see what happens in this book. Um, so yeah, The Oracle Glass by Judith Riley's book, my second book on my book haul today. My third book is Hallowed by Cynthia Hand. It's, the un, it's book two in the Unearthly series. And book one was Unearthly. And I finished that this week. I couldn't put it down. I really, really enjoyed it. I had to go out and get book two just to see what happens with these wonderful characters and in this great, great new society that they're building and um, who she is and how she plays this game and um you know, being an angel. It's just fantastic. So I couldn't get enough of it, so I had to go out and get the companion novel, well, the second one in the series. So then, um, you know, most of you know that I do the majority of my reading on my Kindle, but I have just fallen in love with a couple of books and I wanted to go out and get them. So the first book I have for you today, my first one um, for, ooh, it's got glare on it really bad. Okay, is Legend by Mary Lou. So I heard amazing things about this book um, on Goodreads and on here on with other booktubers. So I couldn't not get it. So and I just thought it was such a great book, like the way it looked and stuff that I had to go get it in um, paperback form. So Legend by Mary Lou. I'm about I'm just about 80 pages in and I'm loving the story. June and Day are fascinating characters. I can't wait to see what happens. My only my only thing that I don't like is that I just found out today that book three um, doesn't come out until the fall. So that freaks me out a little. I, I hate to not I hate to have to wait for books. Um, to come out. So I, I'll try to wait on books to make sure the whole series is out before I start reading them just be, for that main purpose. But I couldn't um, not get this one. It just looked really too really good. So yeah. So Legend by Mary Lou. It's what I'm reading now. Okay. So the next book I got um, at the bookstore was Beautiful Creatures by, who is it by? I'm sorry. I should know this. Maria Garcia. Oh my gosh. We'll start this. We'll start this part over because you don't. Uh... Okay. So the second book I got at the bookstore this week <laughs> is Beautiful Creatures by Carrie. It's Cami Garcia and Margaret Stoll. So I think I'm the only person um, in BookTube. Um, and probably sounds like the world who is a big book lover who hasn't read this. I saw the previews and I was like, oh, that looks good. But I, if it's a book adaptation, I want to read the book first. And I never got around to getting it. So here it is. I got it for a really good deal um, at Barnes and Nobles yesterday. So I went ahead and picked it up. I'm excited to read it. It's kind of thick for me. And um, so it, I'm really interested in seeing how this one plays out. So Beautiful Creatures um, is one I will be reading soon. I'm excited about that one too. Okay, so my last book in my book haul today is <laughs> Dan Brown's Inferno. Now, I loved 
Angels and Demons. I thought that was one of the best books I'd ever read. Funny fact when I was reading it, um, I was convinced that something horrible was going to happen. I was homesick and reading it, had a horrible sinus infection, uh, and got a bloody nose just as one of the horrible parts of the book, and I threw the book across the room and scared me half to death. That's just that's just one of my things. So, funny story. So, I'm really excited in books that I, I'm an, author, I'm an author as well, and I do a lot of talk about the Infernos and Dante, and so I'm really excited to see what Dan Brown does with this book and see what happens, and I got it in nice hardcover, nice hardcover book book. The only thing that I regret is I saw somebody from uh, the UK have one, and their book their hardcover part book. Mine is plain. See, look. Mine is plain. It's just plain. Take the cover, the dust cover off, and it's just plain. But the ones in the UK are so cool looking. They have like like engravings on it. I'm like, I tried to find that one, couldn't find it. So whatever. So, but Dan Brown's Inferno. I'm really excited to read this one as well. So, so that's my book haul for you. Uh, let me know if there's something you think that I should read. If there's something you think that I'm missing out on, I would love to hear from you. Make sure that you com comment below and I'll make sure to put all the links to all the places you can find me and my written reviews as well um, to my blog below as well. So I hope you enjoyed my book haul. I'll have another one coming up for you in a couple weeks. And of course my reviews are all always coming. So have a good one. Bye-bye.